All right, everyone. So today that is the hen that we are going to be moving back into her flock. Uh, she's been a mother hen for almost four months now. So this baby is completely grown up and ready to be by herself. Uh, we believe it's a female. That's at least what it looks like. It hasn't, it hasn't grown any crazy tail feathers or any saddle feathers. So it, it's looking like a female right now. And the mother hen is obviously a female too. So they've been doing good together. And they've just been staying inside of this 4x8 with the door right there outside as you can see and so right now it is time for her to go back to her main flock which are the chocolate silver lace serpentins which is what she is and so then we will have eight hens uh there and then one rooster so let me go show you that flock right now all right guys and here is the chocolate silver lace orpington flock uh i think there are three hens inside right now they're probably all laying eggs and there's the rooster so we have seven hens inside of here with one rooster now the most ideal ratio i think is anywhere from eight to ten hens with one rooster but right now uh since we only have about eight chocolate silver lace serpentine hens that's what we're gonna do uh and right now he's been with seven which has been completely fine uh, a couple of them have some backs that are a little bit uh bare but if we let him uh go into a rooster coop which is why we have them and you guys have always been telling me in the comments especially in my with my shorts that uh, I'm really mean keeping the roosters inside the small coop but I don't think they understand that I interchange them every couple of weeks so that they can be with the hens uh, and rotate them actually it's for their their benefit so that we don't have to cull them and eat them so that's that's probably better than what they would want so we have these hens here and we can keep them like I was saying we can take that rooster out and let them grow back their feathers but he has enough hens uh, to mate in between, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be introducing, we're gonna be introducing that hen into this flock. All right guys, so I have the hen with me. I also have some plants so they aren't totally focused. Just so they aren't totally focused on her, but they can all scratch around and eat a little bit. So I'm just gonna set her down. Let's see what happens. Immediately, you can tell she's the most beautiful hen in here. They just had to figure out who was higher and who was lower in rank. So actually it went much better than i thought it could have been much much worse and unfortunately i can't show the hens uh finding out who's higher and pecking in the pecking order on youtube she has uh some really really beautiful feather patterns that is really a true chocolate silver lace serpentine as you can see those those feathers are extremely beautiful so uh let's go check on that little baby chick and see how she's doing and then <laughs> all right and this little hen is just standing at the door like where is my mom well she's gonna have to learn to be by herself for just a little bit and then we can introduce her to her uh other family which is these chickens over here which is who she actually belongs to so she belongs to these ones here as you can see this is the rooster that i made the alien video on uh, how his comb is so weird and it literally just looks like an alien his whole head he just everything is huge on him He's crazy And then that's a rooster and that one right there is the hen. They are extremely beautiful black and white like checkered splash pattern Never seen a chicken like that before but they are absolutely beautiful And so that's the type of baby chick that the little hen is there and so yeah all right guys so hopefully you enjoyed that video uh, i just wanted to you know hopefully make a couple weekly videos for you guys uh to show you what's going on because i know you enjoy them and uh, i'll give you probably an update on this little hen uh soon a little after this video comes out and we will see how she does with her mother not being around may have to put the mother back but we'll see so uh, yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed it that'll do it for today's video i'll see you guys on the next one goodbye